For the first time in six years, workers from DOE Prime Contractor Mission Support Alliance removed the welds around the door and stepped inside Hanford's F reactor. Long-term stewardship is the next phase of Hanford. And Hanford, and as the Hanford cleanup is completed along the Columbia River out here, we're transitioning these lands to the long-term stewardship and the long-term stewardship program. The inspection gave MSA the opportunity to conduct required radiological and structural surveys of the cocooned reactor. The surveillance and maintenance program, periodically we go in and open up reactors and go in just to, just to do some radiological sampling, see if there's any, any roof leaks, or that sort of thing. But the inspection this time showed very little changes and it looks good and safe. The 105F reactor, the last of three original plutonium production reactors constructed as part of the top secret Manhattan project during World War II, operated from 1945 to 1965. The reactor was sealed in a secure cocoon state in 2003. The cocooning process, also called interim safe storage, allows time for radiation levels to decay. The inspection satisfies a modified requirement in the Hanford Triparty Agreement that states the surveillance and maintenance of the F-reactor must take place in fiscal year 2015. The MSA is very proud of the long-term stewardship program. We've built it from its infancy with DOE, only site in the complex to have its own long-term stewardship program. That we've, uh, you know, we're, we're taking over lands and reactors. With the inspections complete, the reactor door has been resealed until the next entry period.